Hi guys, thank you for watching Beauty Box. I'm Hayes Betts. I've got a haul for you today. Um, this is over a couple of weeks. A couple of weeks. Um, I didn't buy it all. There are a couple of bits in here that were bought for me or given to me or free or whatever. Um, I've just finally had a little bit of money so we went Christmas shopping and picked up a couple of bits for myself. So. I'm just going to dive in and show you what I've got. The first thing I'm going to show you, these came today. I'm really excited. My new business cards for my nails. Um, I got these free. I just had to pay postage at Vistaprint. And these, I'm just going to block out my mobile number at the bottom, but these are my new business cards. <laughs> so happy. And it's just got like all my details, like beauty box nails, blah, blah, blah. So finally got my business card, so I'm happy. That's part of my haul. Um, I've got a couple of Avon products. My Avon all came today. And most of the stuff that I've ordered is all Christmas stuff. But um, there were a couple of bits in there for me, including these two. Um, I've bought, I finally took the plunge and bought a Kabuki brush. These are in the new demo book. So they'll be coming into brochure one, I think. And it's just a little mini Kabuki brush with a metal bottom and um, bristles are very very soft mm, can't wait to use that so I finally took the plunge and bought a kabuki and it's really cute it comes in this cute little case as well which is nice and then I bought these which are diamond shimmer pearls I've never used these before um, they look really nice they do bronzing ones as well it just comes in a pot like this and then you just take the top off and it comes with a big sponge but I'm not going to use the sponge I'm going to use like um, a brush or something and then there's all your pearls inside there's three different colours there's white then there's like a peachy colour and then there's the pink and you just sort of dab your brush in put it on job done so I'm going to see how I get on with them I can't tell you any prices because I can't remember half the prices to be honest Mark bought me this from work. How cute is that? They had like four different ones. They had one dressed as a strawberry, this one, and then a couple of others. And he bought me that one. And that was so cute. And that was from um, Tesco Express. And it was on a clip strip. And it was one ninety nine. so I was quite impressed with that. One ninety nine for Hello Kitty. Hang on. I've left out my stuff over here. Sorry. Um, I went to Superdrug on Sunday when I went Christmas shopping and I needed to get a couple new nail varnishes obviously because I'm a nail technician I have to keep on top of my nail varnishes um, so I ended up with four barrels <laughs> so bad um, so I bought the black one because I needed a new black anyway and then I wanted sherbet, not sherbet I wanted lemon ice cream but then I saw this one and I wanted this one more and this is just yellow which I've actually got on at the moment with purple crackle, probably can't see in this light because this light's disgusting. The yellow is 134, the black is 47. And then they've brought out two new shatters. So, being as I've got the other four, I had to get these two. These are 321 and 322, and it's the gold glittery one. And this one is purple. And I've got the purple on over my yellow on my nails. But again, the light in here is so atrocious, you probably can't even see it. Um, I got a few bits from Tesco. I wanted to get a glow in the dark nail varnish, and Tesco had it for like a pound, so I got one. Um, I haven't tested it in the dark because every time I've put it on, after a couple of hours of it being dry, it's like gone all sticky and horrible, and you have to peel it off. So I think what I've got to do is put it on and then put top coat over it to seal it. But um, I haven't tried it yet. It doesn't glow in the dark in the bottle, so I'm hoping when it goes on your nails, it glows in the dark. I'll find you my other Tesco bit while I'm here. I bought this. This was before the Halloween um, clearance because obviously yesterday Tesco reduced all their Halloween stuff. But I bought this before the Halloween reductions, which is probably a good thing because I didn't have any of these when I went in. Um, and it's this. It's a coffin makeup set and the only reason I bought this is for the eyelashes and this is £2 
Um, it did have some black nails at the top as well. Um, if you watch my Rocky Horror outfit of the day, you'll see that I've got these really massive spooky eyelashes on. I bought them from Tesco about four years ago, and they were like £1.50. And I've never been able to find them again. And these aren't the same, but they're very similar. And I thought, well, two quid for a pair of lashes is pretty good. And I absolutely love them. So, the other stuff will get used at some point. I mean, there's a red lipstick in there. There's um, fake blood. And then you've got your four face paints at the bottom. So, they'll probably come into something. But again, two quid for the eyelashes. I thought it was a bargain. Um, I also bought these eyelashes. They had a lot of these in. These were a pound. I know they have them in gold and silver. I think they had rainbow ones as well. And they have these ones, which are pink. I just thought they were cute. They're probably crap, but for a pound, I'm happy to try them. It would be a bit fun. Um, I got some tinsel. I got about six of these. These were all reduced to 12p. Why do you need tinsel on Halloween? I don't get that one. But um, the reason I got them is because at Christmas I have a rainbow tree. I have loads of different coloured stuff on my tree. I don't like stick to two or three colours. I have everything. And I really liked this. They had this in black and silver, black and pink, and black and orange. Well, I've, I've seen pink and silver tinsel before. But I've never seen orange. So I've got like three of these to go on my Christmas tree. Well, six of these, sorry, to go on my Christmas tree. Um... I went in Tesco yesterday and Jess found these and they're so cute. These were all supposed to be half price, but they actually went through the till even cheaper. They were supposed to they were originally three pound, then they were reduced to one fifty, but they went through the till at seventy five p, which was quite cool. And it's these. One of them wants to be upside down. Set of three earrings. And they're so cute. You got cats, bats and hats, which I thought was quite funny. But they're so cute. I love the little bat ones, the little bat ones are so cute, but I thought all well, for 75p, loving it, so I got those, and then when I went Christmas shopping I was very good girl, I bought all the rest of the birthday cards that I need for the rest of the year, and I bought all the special Christmas cards, so then I thought I just need to buy my box cards, went in Tesco yesterday, they've got all their box cards out, and I saw some and I was like, I've got to get them. So these were on offer. I've got three boxes. Um, you get 30 in each box. They were £2 a box, three for two. So for £4, you got 90 cards, which I thought was quite cool. So I got these ones, which are cars. I thought they were quite cute. So you've got Lightning, the police guy, I can't remember his name, Lightning again, and Mater. So I thought they were pretty cute. I thought Mark would like them ones. And then I got two boxes the same. I saw these and I had to get them. And you'll know, you'll see why. I fell in love with them. They're Hello Kitty Christmas cards. Oh my God! Look, look how cute. That one. I like the last one. No, I like that one. I like the giraffe. They're so cute. So people are getting really girly Christmas cards this year fell in love with them. Um, I've got a couple of bits that were bought, well this was bought for me, this was from Jess. She got this off eBay and it's just a Hello Kitty. You think, oh it's just a plastic Hello Kitty, but you switch it on and it lights up. How cute. I thought it was really nice of her to get me that and it just changes colour. I thought that was really cute, so I got that. And then um, I got another magazine freebie saved for me. And this, I'm in love with this worst clasp in the world. It's a pain in the bum to get on and off. But I absolutely love it. And this was in Girl Talk, I think. How sad is that? But no, it's, it's a rainbow with clouds. And I just thought that was so cute. And Jess got one as well. And she wore hers and she got like six comments. Oh, where'd you get your necklace? Where'd you get your necklace? So, I love it. So that's that. I've also been to a factory shop. Um, got loads of Christmas stuff. I bought some boring stuff in there as well, like pens and notebooks and stuff that you don't need to see. I bought this. I bought a onesie. I took the plunge and I bought a onesie. And I'm not going to show you the whole thing because it's too big. But um, this is the material, leopard print. It hasn't got a hood, and it hasn't got feet. So technically, it's not. Well, it is a onesie, but it hasn't got feet. But, um, 
It was 15 quid and it's cute, so I've got that. And then I saw this and I had to buy it and Jess told me off because she was going to buy me it for Christmas, but I had to buy it. And this was £6. They do two different ones. They do a yellow one with um, a t-shirt on that says bad and then they do this one. <gasps> and they are proper Hello Kitty. They're Sanrio license on them. I love it. It just makes me think of David Bowie. Bowie, Bowie, however you pronounce it. Because of the hello, I love it. And she sleeps with me at night. So I got that. Uh, where else have I been? I went to Asda. I've actually got some new jammers, and I'm so excited. There are 20 to 22, and they fit. And like normally in jammers, I have to get like a 26 to 28 but not anymore because I've lost a stone and a half so far and I've now got new jammies so I'm just going to... These are the trousers. They're red and fleecy and they've got snowflakes on them because they're super cute. And then the top, I'm going to try and... I'm not going to stand up and embarrass myself but the top is like that. It's got doggies on and it's short sleeved and it's very comfortable and they were £6 each so loving those. Um, what else have I got? I bought this off eBay. I've seen lots of reviews on a brand of these, and these aren't the brand. These are the cheap version, but I, I fell in love with them. And they're lip stickers. They're like temporary tattoos that you put on with water, but they're for your lips. And I got these ones. And they're so pretty. They've got roses on. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to do a video tutorial on how to put these on, and what I think of them. And, um... I'm not doing it tonight, but I am going to do it. But they're just... They're so pretty. My ro my mouth's going to have roses on it. And they do all different ones. They do Union Jack. They do um, leopard print. They do glitters. Oh, they're amazing. I think that was like a pound. So I got one of them. Uh, lastly, I wanted a new hoodie, like fleece jacket thing. Couldn't find one anywhere. Went in New Look and they got loads of cardy things in, which I didn't really want, but I, I saw this one and I thought it was really cute. So I've got this. This is in a 22. Oh, so excited. And it's grey. And it's got long sleeves, obviously. And it's got one of these collars that, like, folds down. And it's got pockets. The only thing I hate about this top is the way that you do it up. It doesn't have any sort of fasteners except two ribbons got two ribbons and you just tie it together which I don't like so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to wrap it round and then put a belt on but um I really like it and I love long sleeves I love it when they're not when they're like that I, I hate it when you buy a jacket or a jumper or something and the sleeves are like when you move your arms they go like that that really annoys me so it's got nice long sleeves it's all cosy and warm and this was twenty twenty six ninety nine. So it's a little bit pricey but it's um knitwear. I even I think the the label's so cute. I'm very easily amused, but um it says knitwear one hundred percent love and I just thought that label was really cute. So that's about it. Like I said, the only other stuff I bought was all boring stuff that you don't need to see. Um and Christmas stuff that I really want to show you but I can't because I'll get in trouble because people will find out what they're getting for Christmas. The only other thing we've got, I don't know if you can see it on top of the TV, but we've finally got a Connect. Mark wore me down <laughs> and got a Connect and it was with three games. It came with Connect Adventures, Joyride and Connect Malls. And from Toys R Us that was a hundred and thirty. Which sounds a lot, but you <sighs> You can go and get one from places like Half Home Warehouse for £80, brand new, but there's no games with it. You then have to go out and buy the games. So, it was pretty cool. Well, he, he wore me down, so I let him have one, but that's it now. No more games for the rest of the year. <laughs> but, um, I just want to show you these as well. These aren't mine, but I got these from Asda. They are so cute. I got them for any look. And they've got glittery fur around the top and they've got fastenings that say Hello Kitty and I just they love, I wish they did them in my size because I'm in with them but I got them for her. They were £12. 
but I saw them and I was like, oh, she's got to have them. So, that's about it. I'm going to shut up now and let you all enjoy your evening. And um, I hope you enjoyed my whole video. And I will see you all soon. Bye.